of the Man of Achievement recipient. to set a record. Mr. Miller knows me very well. It's almost impossible for me to talk about what I'm doing in less than a minute, but I'm going to do my best. Um, I just want to share with you guys a quick, couple quick things about the whole project. It's a pilot training program for the young men and women who a large part of society has gave up on. So when you guys are driving home from work and you see those young people with the dreadlocks and their pants hanging down, or maybe you see a young lady maybe with two, maybe even three kids, those are the young people that I target. Those are the young people that I have not thought about them. Those are the young people that are now taking ownership and control of their own destiny. I have named myself the spokesperson for young adults in the Washington metropolitan area. So if you see me on TV, if you hear me on the radio, you can say, I know that skinny little man. I met him personally. I'm the person who's challenging the city to do more for young adults. My passion is to help anyone that is between the ages of 18 and 25 who would like to do more than just work at McDonald's or maybe work retail. My job is to help my young people have some hope. So thank you all for allowing me to be a part of this occasion. Mr. Miller, thank you for nominating me for, for this award. God bless you all. And just one last thing. Pastor, you said it earlier. The road I traveled to get here has been rough, but I'm a black man on stage standing up and not in church laying down in a casket. Thank you very much. Now, it gives me great pleasure to introduce our